For the latest top tips, reviews and advice, please subscribe below. Hello and welcome to Atmos Camping and Leisure with me, Mike. Today I'm giving you a preview into the 2017 range of tents from Van Gogh. So it's a little snippet, I'm up here in Glasgow looking through some of the new product that will be launched ready for 2017. Retailers like ourselves, there's a very few in the UK, uh, will be getting stock of all this new stuff come November. So if you want a chance to sort of get your tent early, great idea. We will be having uh, quite a lot of these up actually in the display room at our Winston Shore, so you can come and check out the new models. So the one behind me here um, is actually taken over from probably what was one of the best selling models for the 2016 season. So this is the Poly Cotton um, Illusion. So it's the Illusion TC 800XL. So this actually replaces is the Rhapsody 800XL. So the Rhapsody is no longer replaced with this. And to be honest, it's kind of uh, a brilliant thing to do. So in years gone by, the best selling tent really in the year for Van Gogh has been their Illusion 800. So why not make a polycotton version of it? It's the one everyone's asking for, and certainly last year, um, there were pretty much none left in the whole country. So there was a real s supply issue because everyone was after that one tent. So all they've done is like, almost like a carbon copy of it, certainly size-wise and pretty much specification-wise um, in polycotton. So it's a great feature, and certainly um, in terms of tent, it's the one that I can certainly see majority of people looking towards this year. You've still got the added benefits of obviously the sort of sleeping eight, so you've got six at the back with the main living area, a decent sized canopy area as well. Um, but there are a few tweaks for the 2017 season. So throughout the range of tents that you see from Van Gogh, certainly in the higher end, so the elite or the polycotton range, they've introduced more features. So now everywhere you've got a lovely nice big PVC window, you've got a skylight as well. So you're yeah, going to help get more light in there, feel, feel more bright and airy. Other things they've actually introduced on that, in the inside there, because it's the Elite, they've got zip and down, up and down curtains, so you can zip up to the main panel, and actually that same zip then carries on into the roof. Um, when in, it's in the canopy areas, it does vary whether it will go up to the roof or not, um, but it's a really nice sort of added feature, again, to just add more light inside the tents. Other sort of major thing they have done as well, is they've changed the zip on the front canopy. So what they've now do is rather being a zip just purely along the top, it now starts all the way in on the bottom. So right from right down here, up, over, and down the other side. The purpose of this being is a more thorough way of attaching a canopy onto it, because essentially you're not just leaving it along the top and then pegging it down the side. It's all integral. It means there's much better um, protection against wind and rain coming in from there. So it's, a, yeah, again, a really nice improvement for the 2017 season. You've also got the ability, like I said, of the XL beams, so it's oversized beams in the Illusion and Illusion TC as well. But most importantly, the major change they've added a new size. So in the Illusion range, so the Illusion polyester and then the polycotton, there's now a 500XL model. So in the polycotton models, you've got the Solis 400, which was a brilliant seller and sort of sold out um, sort of March in 2016. So that gets improvements for the 2017 season. You've then got the Illusion 500XL, smaller version. Uh, and we've got a illusion I will show you in the polyester version, that I can, which is a really sort of nice sort of size. And then the main sort of top of the range one, the illusion 800 TC. So three main sizes in polycotton and then same in polyester, you've got the 500 illusion XL and then the 800 XL illusion as well. So great sizes and then lots of scope there as well. So further on in season, um, do check out a review video on these products. So there should be one for each individual tent. So yet again, you guys at home know what's going on and certain features, I will be doing one of those. So you can certainly check it out a bit later on the season, but we'll have a little look around here and see what other uh, gems we can find. So what Van Gogh have done with this particular model behind me here is sort of merge sort of their two of their better selling tents together. So we all know of the uh, Van Gogh Eclipse and we all know the Van Gogh Inspire. So what they've done is combine those two together to make the Van Gogh Inspire 800 double XL. So the principle of being is you've got the lovely, big, nice, spacious living area of the Eclipse, but the canopy of the Inspire. So it's a really nice sort of new model for the 2017 season. And it's one of those sort of things that throws a curve ball in mainly when it's up against the illusion. So I think it's gonna be a very closely contested uh, battle between sort of the Inspire and the Illusion for the 2017 season on which probably would be 
the best seller for Van Gogh. Um, certainly, obviously, with something like this, it's more money, but it's more space involved. But it's something like then we'll certainly be trying to look at maybe putting up in our indoor display room at that walls to you guys to have a look at um, because it is real humdigger. It still has all the features, like I said, about the Illusion TC. So things like the skylights along top, the windows that cover it. Uh, you've also got the ability of the large beams. Uh, what they've also done as well is uh, increase the ventilation panels. So the low level ventilation points have increased by 50%. Uh, and also the bit over the bedroom has also increased by 50%, mainly just trying to combat condensation because uh, it really is sort of a, a bit of a problem these days when you've got compressed air inside the, sort of the inner tubes and in the tent with a sonium ground sheet. So condensation is really becoming a big battle. So that's why companies like Van Gogh tend to be um, sort of try and put more ventilation to get a good circulation of air in. You've still got the ability of a complete full zip on the front as well, and you can actually buy what they're calling sort of a, um, a porch door. So if you wanted to make this open canopy enclosed, you can quite happily do so with this sort of unique porch door. So some really nice points on this particular model as well. Um, comes with sort of a nice wheelie bag. Optional extras obviously is like the footprints, carpets, skyliners as well, which sort of carries on throughout the range uh, with Van Gogh. But Really nice model again, something to look forward to for the 2017 season. Yet again, one will be stocking. But um, we'll have a quick look at the uh, Illusion 500XL now on the inside and just talk a bit about that as well. So this behind, behind me is the Illusion 500XL. So like I said, it's a new model for the 2017 season, a new sort of size. So you've got all the benefits of the 800, which we know uh, being sort of bang is one of the best selling tents they've done for the last sort of two, three years now. So it's a smaller size, more meant for sort of maybe a family four um, or sort of a family five. Um, so you've still got, like I said, a decent living area, a really good canopy area as well, uh, which you can obviously make enclosed, but you've got the sort of the the brilliant sort of fabric of the 420 denier. So like I said, you've got this in the 500 XL, they still did the 800 XL, which is a real good sort of consideration um, if you want some like, high-end spec inflatable tent, which has obviously got all the bells and whistles that you want. A new feature on sort of all of their um, upper range fabrics, so things like the um, Illusion range, the Adorus 500 XL range and Rimdale, so your sort of elite um, and then also your uh, polycotton ranges, they've got a new thing called Skytrack. So the Skytrack system is designed basically on a, almost like a cader that runs where the beams are. So the principle is you can actually slide things along and pretty much make your own tent very customized to you. So you can put hanging points where you want to, you can put the cable ties when you want to, you can add extra accessories to go across the middle. Um, so it's a it, really nice little feature which they've sort of um, pattern painted um, sort of for tents and awnings. Um, so it's a great little thing that Van Gogh improved on for the 2017 season. Um, and it's, I can see certainly further on down the line, them adding more and more and more accessories specifically for your tents. So this is sort of the future part of what Van Gogh are probably looking to span out over the sort of the next sort of one or two and probably longer years to come. Like I said, good model, perfect size, um, and certainly probably a lot of mileage. And I think it will create a bit more of a buzz about this newer, smaller size for sort of families. So this is basically the Illusion 500XL. Another new model for the Elite range sitting at the top of Van Gogh's um, real nice inflatable tents is the Maritza. So it's a name that um, everyone uh, in the camping industry is familiar with, the Van Gogh Maritza 600XL. So they've made actually an inflatable model of it. Um, so the joys of this is you've still got the ability to sleep back, you've got a nice sort of panoramic front um, and a canopy area as well. So it's taken one of their best selling tents probably that Van Gogh have ever done. Um, made an inflatable version of it uh, and it's a really nice model to be fair. The only sort of downside we would slightly say is probably now with the likes of the Illusion 800 you probably is about 50, 50 to 100 pound difference between the price points and I just feel the Illusion's probably got a little bit more to it but it's a really nice mo model to see in sort of the range and yet again certainly got a bit of scope with something like the more traditional sightings. If you've currently got a uh, Van Gogh Maritza, whether it be a five, six or 700 in the past, and you think, do you know what, I just want the same style, just quicker and easier to put up. Ideal, really nice model. And we do have a, um, often a lot of Maritza customers come to us, you know, who do want something similar. And, and 
pretty much Van Gogh answered their uh, prayers <laughs> in many ways. So um, good model, like I said, in terms of specification wise, 420 denier fabric, so still elite fabric, same as the Illusion and the Inspire XL. Um, so plenty of sort of wear and tear there, so it's going to last nice and long. Lovely big windows with new skyliners, the full length zip, and you can get extra optional sun canopies and also uh, front awnings uh, for it. So it's a really good range and like I said, plenty of depth with the footprints and carpets and uh, skyliners. There's plenty of optional extras you can look at it to, hit, to make it your own bespoke little baby really. But um, a nice model, good to see it back in the range. Um, but there are other twists and tails to what Mango have got in store for the 2017 season. So a new addition um, into the gazebo inflatable range that Vango do is they have great success with the uh, Vango Air Hub. So this here is a new model, this is the Hexi Air Hub. So the joys of this, it's yet again a nice really open areaed uh, gazebo, which yet again is inflatable, so it's nice and quick and easy to put up. But the joys of it as well is you've got detachable ground sheets that sort of clip in, clip out. It comes completely enclosed with panels and then each panel has got a mesh part. So what is you've got um, one, two, three panels which can sort of sit back and toggle back, and then you've got three which almost just complete wind mesh windows with the ability to zip it up to make it sort of enclosed so you can keep it quite um, neat and tidy and store things in there, no problem. But as we know, certainly from last year with the Air Hub, the quick and ease of it going up was a great plus point. Comes in two colours, yet again, herbal to match your tent, or obviously the smoke colour to match your awning. So a really nice range and a good addition to the range. So a new model behind me here is the uh, Diablo range. So uh, Van Gogh have created, um, with the success of the Palermo last year, they've created a Diablo range, which is obviously, again, an old name that we know like a Maritza um, from years gone by. So they've tweaked it and made it inflatable. So you've got the ability to sleep 12 or 9. So they do a Diablo 900XL, or this one behind me is the 1200XL. So it's like a potted style tent, uh, which obviously allows you to have separate sleeping areas to your kids, it's completely separate as well, so it's a really nice area. If you've got this, this front canopy, it just gives that extra plus point that the Palermo didn't really have last year. It gives you a sort of an area you can actually quite happily cook underneath. So that's a really great little feature again that you can add to sort of the model. Obviously it sits in sort of the 150 denier range, uh, so about 5,000 mil high straight ahead. So a really strong waterproof level, but the joys obviously of the zip up and down curtains, the skylights, so loads of features packed inside of that as well. So. Uh, brilliant little model. Like I said, certainly, it's certainly got a lot of leverage, uh, and I think for those people looking for that separate area, it does offer quite a lot of uh, tent really for your money. So behind me here, I've got a, um, a nice little new size again. So this is the Rivendell 500XL. So in the 2016 season, they did make a uh, 800XL, uh, which still carries on into the 2017 season, and actually remains at sort of the same price. They've introduced a new model, which is a 500 XL. So again, same sort of specifications in terms of 150 denier. Um, you've got sort of zip up and down curtains. They sort of added the extra features of sort of things like the skylights into the range. You've still got the ability, um, obviously, of the air. So it's quick and easy to put up. Um, but the new size 500 again offers that. It's just something a little bit different for those families who just don't want something quite so big. A new modification they made for sort of the Rivendell 800 and the 500 is they've introduced a second side door. So initially, last year's model only had sort of one side door on the left, one on the front. Now you've got a nice one on the right hand side with a mesh panel as well. So the joys of that actually is it gives it more air, more light inside of it. They've changed the pitch of the roof as well to make it a bit more upright. So yet again, inside, even though it's the same footprint, it feels more airy and a bit more spacious. So a really good idea there, I think. Just a small little tweak, but it does make quite a bit of a difference. So. Yet again, for something you want, something you haven't got the earth to spend on something, you know, like an inflatable tent, you can still get a good amount of specification with a good fabric and obviously the quicker ease of air right here with the Rivendell. You've still got tweaks of things like the zip, the full length zip that goes all the way around and the sky rail, which I mentioned earlier with things like the Illusion. So the whole of this sort of range here um, with the Elite range, which you've got over there, and then this range, so like the Adorus 500XL, the Rivendell, that sort of thing, all has the good features that you necessarily want inside your tent. Um, but we'll have a quick look at a new size that they've introduced into the uh, Adorus range of models. So this is the model I was talking about. This is the new 
uh, Adorus 400XL. So it fits nicely in the range with the 500XL and the 600XL. Uh, they're still doing the 400 and 500. The XL obviously means you get the double size living area. So it makes it a nice bigger size tent so you can still sleep four people, have a decent size living area and then still got the canopy area as well. Um, like I've been sort of repeating really is you still get the benefits of the skylights on the top, the uh, sky track system, um, the ability obviously of inflating it all individually and make it nice and quick and easy to go up. You've also got the ability of the new full zip on the front and they've introduced a um, porch door. So what you can actually do is create um, a, a complo completely enclosed front or by the extension. So the joys of this actually is, is you can actually make it sort of physically shut in front of there or have it a bit bigger if you want to. So it just adds that bit more versatileness into the tent and certainly I think makes a, quite a big difference. As with the Rivendells, as I explained earlier, you've got an extra side door here as well, which has got a mesh panel in, so you've got the ability to make it feel more light and breezy inside, uh, so you get a good circulation of air. You've still got the benefits of the uh, sort of 50% extra ventilation below the windows, and they've also introduced an extra ventilation part where the bedroom area is on both sides, um, so you can again help with condensation. Um, but a really nice model, one thing that's not actually evident from this particular model for the 2017 range, they're going to be changing the colour of the guide ropes, just because last year they felt they were a little bit dark and weren't as obvious as they should be. So that's a little model tweak and change that will be happening in time for the 2017 season. What we'll do now is we'll go on to the, um, basically, the Tega range. So you've got the Tega, the Centara, and have a little bit of look at like, things like the Paloma as well. So um, we'll go through that range next. So uh, let's lead the way. So now behind me here, I've got the uh, Van Gogh Capri range. So they've obviously got 400, 500. They've now introduced a new 400XL. And also you've got the 500XL and 600XL of years gone by. So the 400XL, obviously you get the nice width of the four man, but a bit bigger in the sort of living area. The problem with the 400 normally was that you couldn't really stand up in the bedroom area, nor did you have any sort of reasonable living area. So a nice new tweak. And one of the probably most important things in terms of changes for the 2017 season is the ability to put a porch door on it. So this actually porch door, they do, like I said, a 400, 500 and 600. Purpose of being really is you can actually now enclose that front canopy. So if you've got a Capri of years gone by, you can actually add that enclosed front to create almost like a separate tent. So you've then got a nice sheltered sort of front canopy area. So admittedly the one we've got here is actually a sample. So it's not 100% out how it's gonna be when it's launched for 2017, but you will have the ability of having um, sort of a, a half door and you've got sort of win two window panels and mesh panels in the front there. So it's a really good new item that you can buy for any sort of Capri down the line that you've had. So quite excited really just to again offer that and give customers like yourselves a little bit of a difference ready for the 2017 season. Um, other tweaks they've made in this sort of collection of ranges, things like the Palomo, pretty much goes on unchanged. You can buy a new sort of Skyliners and that tends to be the theme really for these sort of range of tents that Skylines are available to help with sort of condensation. The Centaur 800 pretty much goes on as it did, but there's a new size in the Tega. So last year there was a Tega 600 XL and a Tega 500. They've now made it a Tega 500 XL. So they've given you double the living area in the Tega just to make it a bit more roomy. It actually changed the tent quite a lot. I mean, there is probably a small price difference between sort of the 500 XL and the 600 XL. For me, I feel that the 600 XL has still got more to it, but the 500 is um, pretty respectable in its own field, really. So um, for me, I still see the Tega 600 XL probably being the biggest um, tent that Van Gogh do in terms of numbers wise, and you can certainly see why, because it offers um, such a amount of space, a lot of space, um, and a sort of the free section area, i.e. the living area, sleeping area, and the canopy area um, for such a brilliant, brilliant price. So in this sort of range of tents, like I said, it's more the 70 denier style, um, offering more price, price pointed inflatableness. Um, really good legs there, and obviously plenty to talk about, um, but we'll move on to sort of the polled ranges and see what's going on there. So now inside the pad store, which obviously was a uh, incredible seller for 2016 season, uh, something we were offering obviously a really good package deal onto and it's something that continues on to the 2017 season. So you've got the ability obviously to five people 
decent sort of a reasonable size living area and a nice big canopy area. Um, it's pretty much near enough the same tent, just with a few sort of uh, add-ons you can actually put onto the tent. So one of the main things actually there is a, a new porch door you can put on the front to make it completely enclosed. Um, similar to um, the sort of things in the airbeam side of things that you can add on to previous tents as well. So the um, porch door um, again, makes it enclosed. You've got a nice sort of semi-circled open door with two windows at the front and a mesh panel as well. So you, again, in terms of size, really positive got the sewn in ground sheet as well so there's um, plenty of mileage in there so looking for sort of first time tents brilliant sort of idea and like i said because you've got a great package deal on the go with the footprint and the universal carpet it really does make your money go a lot further than it would normally so uh, a really good model that continues on into the 2017 season so now with me i've got probably the best selling model for the 2016 season in the pole range the arava here. So the Van Gogh Rava, they've actually introduced a new size, they've gone for a 500 XL. So about two years ago they did a 500 but the living area is quite small, so the XL really makes it a really nice big tent. Like I said, there's probably more uh, mileage in the, the 600 XL for a small extra cost, you can get what in my opinion is probably a better tent and bigger tent. For the 2017 season what they've actually done is de it just to keep the price point where it needs to be. So things like the mesh doors on, the, on sort of the side doors, storage pockets all around the inner bedrooms, the zip up down curtains aren't actually in this model. Um, but really for 2017, if you visit our website, we're actually selling the higher spec model, i.e. with the mesh and all the extras they've taken out. So you still will be able to get that just for the 2017 season from us here at Wall. So if you're looking for the Rava and you obviously want the better spec model, probably come to our website because we should have some left in stock. It would pretty much be on a sort of first come first serve basis so just bear that in mind yet again we're doing a really good package deal with the footprint and the official Arava 600 carpet so check out that for the 2017 season but now since that's pretty much for us here in terms of the Van Gogh up in Glasgow for all the polled and air tents um, but yeah really impressive range and something to get excited about ready for the 2017 season.